to my channel. It is the year 2023, which for me sounds really strange, to be honest. Um, and yeah, sorry, I've been away for a little bit, just enjoying with my family. If you haven't seen me before, hi, my name is Shana. I'm a mummy of two to my daughter, Liana, who is six and to my almost two and a half year old son, Dane, who this video is about. And also I have an Italian partner and we split our time between Italy and England. So yes, um, if you've just joined me, thank you for coming and I hope you enjoy. So this video, I'm actually going to be doing a video of what we are getting my son for his birthday because he is turning two in a couple of days, which I cannot believe my son is a toddler already. Where does that time go? Um, and not that I'm having a go, but um, please, this video is not meant to be like bragging. It's just meant to be fun. This is something I enjoy watching and um, doing myself and if I can help any of you out there then that's just great and um, please be respectful as well and um, obviously we have chosen things for our son that we find appropriate and money wise etc some of you may think it's too much some of you may think it's too little but please as parents we already have a hard enough job so please just take this video as it was intended and let's enjoy so starting like, obviously Christmas has just been and he's already got a load of stuff for Christmas. Now it's coming up to his birthday. In February I have my daughters and in March I have my partners. So yeah, I've got a pretty busy couple of months ahead of me. Um, so yeah, for my son is obsessed with cars and when I say obsessed I mean obsessed if you could see the excitement in him when he sees cars so quite a few of these pieces are kind of related to cars i've tried to do a variety of toys because he's at that age now and because he has his older sister he's getting more into things and um, so yeah i'm gonna start with like his main gifts from us and this one it's really big in the box, so I hope you're going to be able to see it. Um, also, guys, I will say where I got all these from on the screen. Um, obviously, some of them are like Italian shops or Italian brands. Um, so if you just look in your local toy shop or Amazon is a great way to find things. Um, so, yeah. And speaking of, um, I found this. Now, if you have seen my videos before, um, you will know I love wooden toys and I love Melissa and Doug. Um, I'm not totally against plastic, but if I had to choose, I would always choose wood. Now, I found this tabletop easel. Now, it come, it's um, a whiteboard and a chalkboard as well. The whiteboard is uh, magnetic, so you get all these magnetic letters. You get a wiper and pens etc so i wanted to get him this because like i said he is starting to get quite creative like wanting to do drawings and stuff but um he i wanted to create an area for him that he could make a mess without making a mess around the house if that makes sense so i got him that easel and to go with it i bought some extra pens and um, these are washable apparently and yeah they're the ones that wipe off so i got him the pens to go with it and i did get him some washable paints as well i'm going to try and start him painting etc i remember when my liana was around this age and she loved doing pictures and paintings um, so I want to start my son um, and try and get him creative as well. Um, so yeah, I got him some washable paints. And to go with it, now this isn't wrapped very nicely, to be fair. Amazon didn't do a very good job at wrapping this, but I just wanted to keep it all together. Um, I'll try and insert a picture instead so you can see what exactly is in there. But I got this art bundle. And basically inside here is all like 
textured um, sponges to make different patterns. There is, I'll try and open some of it. There is what they call paint brushes for toddlers, which means it's just like thicker and a thicker brush. And there is kind of um, the non-spill um, pot. So basically it's got a hole. So, so you don't get paint everywhere. It comes with an apron. And yeah, just basically a whole set just so he can get creative on his little easel. And I don't know if you saw, but on that easel at the top, there is um, a paper roll as well. Um, so I think he's gonna have a lot of fun. So you can pull the paper down. Um, so yeah, I think that's gonna be a good thing. Another item I found, and I only got it to be honest because it was on sale. Um, it was still in like the January sales. And I thought it'd be very useful. I remember my daughter having these um, and it is this. Um, table with these what do they call these again I've forgotten how they call them oh, what do they call it? like brico bits or something they're not quite like um, building blocks they're like this and they've got like little spikes so they all stick together and it was just a really good price in the sale and it's nice that it comes with a foldable table as well which you know easy to store away also that is why i bought the tabletop easel i wanted to get um i did get um think i would get like the standing one and then i thought oh it's the storage of it all so at least with that tabletop easel, I can actually fold it away and it can go away. And this is the same thing. Um, this folds down. And it's just a really great thing for toddlers. You know, all toddlers love building blocks. Dane does have like wooden blocks. He has the big blocks. Um, so I wanted to get him these ones because these ones are a little bit different. And I remember when my daughter, again, was this age, she loved this. But unfortunately, she had like a little hippo that had all these in. But unfortunately, we got rid of it. Um, so, yeah, like I said, got Dane this and it's just really cute. And it was just such a really good price. I just couldn't resist it. And um, like I said, he's seriously into cars. He got a load of cars and little mini cars. He had like an advent calendar um, for Christmas. So he has hundreds of like little cars, medium cars. Um, so I found this um, car mat. Um, I'll show you the back because you can see it better. So basically it just is like a little city. And yeah, I think he's going to love putting this out on the floor and using his cars. I mean, he has the cars everywhere and he puts them on everything. So this, I thought, would be really fun. And what is nice about this, I got a little surprise when I opened it to check it. Um, it actually has a pack of little cars inside and it also has a pack of um, road signs. So he'll be able to put road signs and stuff up. So yeah, again just really good and he's gonna personally love this I know he is and um, so that is that and this next item one thing I love about Amazon when you're looking online sometimes things just pop up and you're like oh my god that is so interesting so this um, is and I'm going to show you the packaging as well because this is so cool now, I actually, a little tip for all you mummies out there, I'm going to take this out. These plastic bags that they come in, just going to show you. If you keep these, you can actually use these as like a wet bag, um, a changing bag, um, because it has this zip bit. They're really handy or snacks, whatever, or for the airplane. So don't throw these out and you can reuse these. So it came in this nice little packaging. And it is this, um, and it's got cars, etc. on, and it is called an erasable doodle pad. And basically, and it comes with all this stuff, basically inside you get just these black pages here, and you also get some clear ones. And what you do is you can write on it, which the pens are provided, I'll show you at the back seat. There's a little compartment here and that has pens and basically you draw on it and you can wipe it away. 
I just thought this was so cute. Um, it folds up nicely like this. This will be great for like when we're on the plane. Like I said, we do split our time between Italy and England and we are planning to go back to England soon. So this is going to be so handy for like the airport or on the trip and um, on the plane. This is also good because we've been doing a lot of trips in the car and um, when we go to restaurants and stuff, my son gets bored very easily. So this is going to be really good for that. What's really cute to go with that book is you get these little bits as well. So you get the wipeable um, cloth so you can wipe away and reuse. You also get the pens, which I showed you at the back. They do also give you two packs of um, wet wipes. You get a book of like these um, drawing inspirations. Um, so yeah, all these different pictures. And you also get a little drawstring bag to keep it all together. So yeah, I thought that was so cute and really good. And it's going to be good to try and keep him amused. Um, so yeah, so like I said, um, his next item... I've been wanting to get him and he got a load of car stuff and um, so I wanted to get him a train set and again I found this gorgeous wooden one. I decided to go for a smaller one this time just because you know I want to see how he likes it first. He got like a racing track, a car racing track for Christmas so I wanted to try this. The fact that it's in wooden I just absolutely love and it's just this cool little set you get all these in it and this has a magnetic so you can lift up the little trucks or whatever so yeah really good with that and it was a really good price as well so yeah I'm happy with this and see how he gets on with it and the next item again I have never seen before and it's something I wanted him to try. And the fact that it's in his favourite thing just made it a plus. And that is Play-Doh. But I found this Play-Doh race car. So basically, you get all the stuff that you can make your own race car. So this is everything you get, um, which was brilliant because this was such a great price. Um, this is actually called Kids Dough, so maybe that's why it was a lot cheaper than Play-Doh. But again, this is something I want to see how he gets on with, with Play-Doh. I do have like a messy mat and, you know, all boys love to be messy anyway. Um, so yeah, I want to see how well he does with this and the fact that it's cars, I think will get him more interested. Um, I think my daughter actually might be giving this to him. Um, she, she usually gives him something. Um, so yeah, she will be giving him this along with an actual motor controlled car. Um, so yeah, basically... It just, it drives, it spins, it does um, wheelies and it, the um, remote is actually sticks onto the back of it. Um, yeah, it's really cute. It's age appropriate. And I think he's just going to absolutely love being able to drive this all around the house. So yeah, his sister will actually be giving him this. And then I do just want to show you some non-toy items. Um, which is including these wellies. Now he has actually worn these because it was raining the other day and we do school runs. So I had to use them and I have to say he has worn them every day. So these are a really great investment and also a like mud suit or rain suit. And um, if I can get a picture, I'm going to have to show you a picture because it's in his bedroom and he's sleeping right now. So I don't want to go and disturb him. But he does have like a rain suit as well. And um, so, yeah, there is that. And he has this adorable outfit, which is actually from my Nana. And I just saw this again in the sales. But it's just so cute. It's got the cars. It's just a nice little zip up jacket and jogging bottoms. Um, yeah, and it was just a different color than what he usually wears. So I thought that was just so adorable. And to go with it, 
we got this um, jacket, which it's a bit thinner. This is for when the weather gets a bit warmer, but it was just a gorgeous um, color and yeah, I love it. So that is that. So I am going to move on to what my mum got and she really helped us out a lot this year and she's been very generous, which she always is. So I am going to show you that. Basically, she got us a load of stuff that we actually needed as well. And um, starting with, which let me just take it out of its bag. I kept it in its bag to keep it clean. And um, with this um, toddler backpack. Now, to be honest, this is actually bigger than I thought. Um, so I don't think I read it properly, to be honest. Um, and yeah, it's cute. I would have loved it if I'd have found one with cars on, to be honest. But I thought, you know, not everything has to be cars. It's a cute little backpack. It's got these little pockets here and it does actually come with a rain as well. However, I'm not sure if this is a little bit too big for him. I feel like if I put this on his back, is it going to be too big? So I may have to change this for a smaller size. I don't know. I'll have to try it out. But yeah, we needed one like this because I don't really need my nappy bag anymore or diaper bag if you're American. And But we just need a bag to keep like his bottle in, his um, doodle pad, you know, some snacks and uh, maybe like a change of clothes and um, pull-ups because we're trying the potty. Um, so yeah, um, but it's cute anyway. So yeah, I wanted to show you and we will have a backpack. I just don't know whether to swap it for a smaller one. And to go with it, just because I saw it and because, it, you know, it's cars and yeah, I found this bottle, but this one has a straw, which my son loves. So I thought, yeah, why not? It can stay with the bag and yeah, it's cute. It's got cars. So yeah. Also from my mom, um, judge me if you want, but we decided to go for a tablet, an iPad, whatever you want to call it for toddlers. Um, I found this one online. Obviously I got blue, not pink. But yeah, basically this is just something, again, like I said, when we travel a lot, um, if we're on the plane, but also even when like I go into town with him, because I'm on my own with him, it's just good to have something you can download his favourite programmes or whatever. Um, let me see if I can show you, because it's better than staring at the box. Sorry, just give me a moment. It's nice and small, to be honest. It's lovely. And yeah, so this is how it looks. Um, it's just going to be really cute and necessary for me. Judge me all you want, but I find them necessary. Um, but yes, and to go with it, um, more so for like the plane or if we're in public places, um, we went for these headphones as well. Um, toddler ones these are the ones for toddlers so they have like they don't go over um a certain um volume for their ears and this one's got like little dinosaurs and stuff on it so yeah i thought that was so cute so thank you mom and then the kind of toy item she's giving him which my son is going to absolutely love is again melissa and doug and it is this wooden um car like dashboard sim stimul uh, simulator sorry i could not say the word then and um, basically it does all the noises and if, i don't know if you can see this can you see like a little car when you move the steering wheel this car actually moves so you look like you're driving the car and um, as soon as i saw this online i thought oh my god yes my son will love this and again, this will be something that could be stored away as well. Because I did debate on whether to get him one of those ride-on cars for around the house. But we're in an apartment and it's not that big. So I thought, no, just go for something like this, which he's going to love. And it makes all the noises and stuff. And it is Melissa and Doug. So, yeah. So that is from my mum and dad, which thank you so much. And from his other grandparents, I will have to just put a picture because they have it. 
and it is this Leb or Duplo um, construction set. Um, it's really cool, obviously they love their Lego and this is like a construction set so I think he will enjoy that. And they are getting like this fun garage as well. It's got like a washing machine or something um, and the cars flip and go down the slide. And so yeah, again, something he'll really enjoy. So that is everything. I hope you found this useful if you are on the lookout for a present to give a two-year-old boy. I have to admit, I struggle in the boy department myself, to be honest. Um, so yeah, if this has helped you, great. Um, please go check out my other channel for other videos because I know also I did a what I'm getting my kids for Christmas. So that has other present ideas. And yeah, come back again to watch me. Bye, guys.